Let's take a look at question 39. Burke refers to the repair of a building in line 70 to 72 to make the point that blank. Okay, so I want to use my rephrase and predict strategy here. So first I want to get control of the language and put this question into my own words. So what is the point Burke is making about the building repair? And now I'm going to find the line reference in the passage, read around it, and make a prediction. So that's line 70, and I even wrote Y here in the margins during the pre-read step. Because that's what I want to keep in my head while I'm trying to answer this question. What's the point? Why? What's the point of this reference? So, okay, so it's lines 70 to 72. And this whole paragraph is about how Burke thinks Britain is good the way it is. Let me start at line 66. Uh, I would not exclude alteration neither, but even when I changed, it should be to preserve. I should be led to my remedy by a great grievance. In what I did, I should follow the example of our ancestors. I would make the reparation as nearly as possible in the style of the building. So if things are really bad, that would make him want to make repairs to the body of British law. But he's saying if British law were a house... If a window broke in that house, he would replace it with a window that matched the style of the old one. So he's saying if they need to make changes to the British Constitution, they should repair it and not rip it up. So my prediction is going to be fix it, don't throw it out. Let's take that prediction back to the choices. I'm going to dismiss the passage again. So here's my prediction. Fix it, don't junk it, blend it in. Let's find the choice that matches that prediction. Uh, so, why does Burke reference repairing a building? What's his point? Does he mean to say that A, governments need to be changed periodically to remain relevant? Burke might agree with this in general, not replacement, but updates. However, that's not the point he's making with this example. Uh, choice B, if a government has fundamental errors, it should be replaced. Now, this doesn't match our prediction at all. It's the opposite. He doesn't recommend wholesale replacement. C. All governments have flaws that may be corrected with the proper intervention. Okay, this choice looks a bit better. Burke would agree that problems can be fixed, but this doesn't match our prediction. This isn't the point that Burke is making with the example. He's not saying, hey, everything can be fixed, which is what this choice suggests. He's saying, as nearly as possible in the style of the building. He's saying, blend it in, right? He's saying, fix it, don't throw it out. I'm not going to cross this one off yet because I just want to see what D is. Uh, and D says, changes to a government should maintain that government's essential qualities. Right. Fix it. Don't junk it. Blend it in. Yeah. D is our answer. So I'm going to knock out choice C. And yeah, D is what we're going with. I took command of this question by rephrasing it in my own words. And then I checked out the line reference in the text. I read around and I made a prediction. And that prediction enabled me to quickly knock out the other choices and find my answer. Good luck out there. You've got this.